question number six diagram three shows triangle boa straight line ox and by are uh, intersects at point p okay so here they intersect ox and by yeah intersect here okay so given that oa is 4a so where's oa oa okay the whole thing here is 4a and then they said ax ax is only this part so here is b and then 3bx equals to 2ba so actually you can form the ratio 3bx over ba equals to 2 and 3 so where is bx huh? bx is here bx is here and then ba is here so they are saying that ba is the whole thing right so the whole thing ratio is 3 and then bx the ratio is 2 okay so that means here ratio is 1 lah. so that means you can straight away know that 1 represents b right so 2 means represents 2b lah. okay so here, here be 2b okay so you don't need the ratio anymore you just you just change it in the form of vector okay next oy equals to okay this one there's some error because eh? the question you see here these two are different thing i think uh this one is wrong eh? supposed to be 3 over 4 not 4 over 3 okay because if it's 4 over 3 it doesn't make sense so okay here right uh, 3 over 4 oa so from here you can also form your ratio oy over oa equals to 3 over 4 so oy is here so here is 3 here is 3 and then oa oa is the entire thing is 4 correct lah 4 so if the entire thing is ratio 4 then here, here will be 3 here will be 1 so that means you can write in the form of ratio is going to be 3a and 1a so here is going to be 3a here is going to be 1a okay so you have already formed your uh, all your vectors now question a they ask you to find ox where is ox ox so ox will be oa plus ax so oa is going to be 3a eh, sorry 4a not 3a plus ax is b so this is your answer the second part they said by by wait a uh, one minute by is where by okay so by you can form your your vector will be ba plus ay so ba is going to be negative 3b and then ay is negative a okay so this one is all done question b let's see yeah okay if op equals to okay so they gave you this equation here op equals to lambda ox such that lambda is a constant find bp rate to the ratio of py bp and py okay so they want to find that ratio so okay wait. we use the this the given formula first so the given formula they, they tell you that op equals to lambda ox what is ox again we have ox from the first part right so ox is this so we can just substitute first 4a plus b so we get 4 lambda a plus lambda b okay so we got op now so now they want us to form this ratio so before we form the ratio we can first form an equation we can first find BP first. So what is BP? BP is actually, let's say we use a, 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 another constant. Lah. We say BP equals to K of the entire thing. We can form a equation. So BP is a fraction of the entire thing. Entire thing is BY, right? The reason why I use BY because we already found BY here. Okay, so we can substitute, we get 
k by is negative okay i write the a first huh? minus 3b equals to negative k a minus 3 k b okay so that is the b y part the back part now b p b p can we form any equation with b p or not b p okay let's see uh. b p we can form b x uh, no we cannot find that o p do we have o p yes we do have o p so that means b p here we can form another equation the equation would be Okay, right here bp equals to bo plus op why i'm using op because we already found the op here right we already found op so now we have to find bo bo is bo will be negative 3b minus 4a okay so this is bo plus op op will be 4 lambda a plus lambda b okay so why are we doing this because we got two equation of bp now right we got two equations so we can combine later okay so let let's simplify this first so a and a we can put them together so we get 4 lambda minus 4 a and then b part we have plus lambda minus 3 b okay so since we have two equations of bp we can combine them so that means 4 lambda minus 4 a plus lambda minus 3 b is equals to the other bp equation so negative k a minus 3 k b okay so what we can do is we can compare the same vector so a and a right we can compare so that means this it should be equals to this 4 lambda minus 4 equals negative k and then the b1 will be lambda minus 3 equals to negative 3k all right so what can we do let's see uh. we can do simultaneous lah. but um okay we shift the negative first we shift the negative so we get 4 minus 4 lambda equals to k so we can take this equation substitute into the second equation so we've got lambda minus 3 equals to negative 3 4 minus 4 lambda so you get negative 12 positive 12 lambda so your answer should be okay let's see ah. Huh? so this lambda i can bring over there so i get become minus right so i will have 11 lambda and then this one i bring over here will become positive so i get 12 minus 3 is 9 okay so i know that lambda is equals to 9 over 11 now that we have already gotten lambda we can substitute lambda back into this equation to find the k value so 4 minus 4 times 9 over 11 equals to k so you just type in your calculator you will get k equals to 8 over 11 so why do we need this because we we want to substitute back into the, our, our original equation here so we know that k is 8 over 11 right so that means uh, bp the ratio of bp over uh, by is equals to 9 uh, sorry 8 over 11 8 over 11 so that means what is the ratio they are looking for that means huh, if we come back to our diagram here so by is the entire thing here right it's the entire thing so we know that the entire thing ratio is 11 so this whole thing here ratio is 11 and we know that bp is 8 bp is 8 so if here is 8 here the whole thing is 11 what is the remaining of py the remaining will be 3 right so since the question is asking for bp to py so bp to py so you know the ratio is going to be the ratio is going to be let me write here 
ratio is going to be 8 to 3. So this is your answer.